there's an infinite runes and charms glitch that you can do currently. And Axie Infinity said it's okay to do it. So you might as well take advantage of it while you currently can. The setup is very simple. First thing you want to do is click inventory. You can already see how it's messed up here because I'm showing twice, but usually you want to click on your moon shards twice. Then you want to come over to crafting and in crafting, you're going to click this spot here. You're going to select moon shard to place it here like this. Then you're going to click craft once. Once you do that, you're going to come back and you're going to click this basic one. So you're going to go from the basic one to this one, the craft and you'll get refunded. And then you just repeat this process and you can do this as much as you want until you get everything that you're looking for. You can just keep repeating the process back and forth. You can see I'm getting runes, I'm getting charms, I'm getting pretty much whatever I absolutely want. And you can just continuously repeat the process. Axie said it's okay, so you might as well take advantage of it while you still can. We're gonna do it a couple more times just to kind of show you how it's done. And it's very simple. Once, once you're doing this, it's pretty much the setup's done. You don't have to do anything else and you just keep collecting. And then you can kind of check on whatever you got at the end. You can just keep seeing, I'm getting refunded. I'm spending 2000, collect it back. Oh, we got some like sticker or something I've never seen before. That's pretty cool. This is also a great way for you to level up so you can have and unlock all these recipes. And the thing is now there was a glitch going on with the recipes where like you would stack these and you would not get what you're supposed to get for spending 13,000. Well, this like now you just kind of keep collecting here. The biggest thing is you're going to see a lot of just common runes though. So it's going to take you a lot of luck to actually even still see the mythics. Every time you're crafting, you're only seeing like a 0.5% chance that you're actually going to get what you want back. And then we'll go and we'll show off everything that we got at the end of this. So I'll see you guys back in like five minutes. So I want to show, uh, it took me about six minutes and I can show exactly how much I got in the six minutes. So I got one of these basic runes, which increases all class bonuses by 15%. Also one that gives more heal and shield, which is really, really strong. And these are just the basic ones. We also got this rare one here, which takes more damage and deal more damage. This is actually really strong because you can make a beast that's very, very powerful from it. Uh, we got no bugs. We got double birds. We got one which poison on the Axie grant one health per stack instead of HP loss. So this could be like a good counter i feel like this is more of something that you play for a tournament than anything else attack cards also deal five damage per energy to all enemies that's actually not bad so you can make a really decent aoe deck if you had something with all three of them being that we also got this one where you start battle with three leaves not multi-attacks consume one leaf and deal 15 damage that's not great because you wouldn't want to consume the leaves in my opinion then we also got this one which axes max hp by 30 at the beginning of your turn gain equal shield to your max hp this is pretty good too no reptile one mech we got the one where it gained damage boost whenever you play a shield card that's not bad definitely can stack it up on a mech and that's kind of all i got for that and then for my charms we got quite a bit of charms here too so you definitely want to take advantage of it while you still can before it gets patched up hopefully you found this video helpful if you did please like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one